Welcome to my channel. My name is Andreas. Recently, Leia have updated the LoomPad, and with it came an application called Leia Tube that allows you to play streaming video from the internet. And I just thought I'd make you aware of it because it opens up a whole new world of content for LoomPad users. So just to be clear, this is not a special YouTube light field application, nor is it a special Vimeo or Facebook or CNN light field application. This is a light field player in its own right. And uh, that has the advantage that you do not need to have special players uh, for all of these different streaming vendors. You can still use the existing applications that you're used to, that you know how to navigate, and use them simply to pass your stream, once you've found them, onto this generic player. Opening the LayerTube app opens up a splash screen. This contains some links to samples of content from some popular streaming video providers. I'll just open these up to show you. This is for Facebook. It opens up the Facebook Watch video page. When you press YouTube, it opens up the video selection playlist compiled by Layer. Vimeo does a similar thing. It opens up a playlist as well. And Twitch opens up the home page from which you can also view videos. And this here, which surprise, surprise, takes you right into this tutorial video that you're watching. But you'll notice that each of these links don't actually open up the layer player itself. They simply open up a playlist. And if you press any of the videos in the playlist, it brings up the player in the host app, not the layer to player. So how then do you actually watch a video in the layer tube app? Well, that's actually even simpler. You don't even need to go and open layer tube at all for this. Just go directly to the video host app, in this case, YouTube. And if you're already there because you pressed the link from the splash screen, that's okay. And from here, simply share the video with LayerTube, like this. And after some initialization, the video starts playing in light field mode. So you can skip back in five second intervals, and you can skip forward in 15 second intervals. And you can also navigate the video using the time control, similar to, you know, other video apps that you would be used to. You can increase or decrease the depth level uh, here, irrespective of the video source. The type of video is generally auto-detected, but if the app does get it wrong for some reason, you can manually set the type of the video, uh, and it will either be a mono, uh, regular 2D video, or a half or full width SBS, that's side by side video. Uh, it can also be a VR360 or a VR360 that is 3D, that has an above and below uh, version of the VR360. Now these are all formats that you can find on YouTube. Uh, if for some reason Layer does get it wrong, there is a feedback button that allows you to feed back to Layer so that they can make corrections to their detection mechanism. And finally, there's also this back button that takes you back to the calling application, which here happens to be YouTube. So now, let me show you that it's not just YouTube videos, but other videos that you can play as well. Here, I'll open up Facebook and navigate to a video. Uh, so for this again, we will share the video. 
Note that I need to press more to get to the layer tube app. And now I press layer tube and away we go. Now let's open up Vimeo and search for a Vimeo video. I'll pick this one and again press the share button. Select layer tube and again we see the video in its full light field glory. By now I think you're getting the pattern here. Uh, it's simply just a matter of sharing your stream with layer tube. But one more. Let's open up the CNN website in Chrome. Now long press on the video on the corner here of the video and select share and then do the same as before and the video plays. There's a second method here as well. Uh, if you select the three dots on the top right corner of the browser and share from here, uh, select layer tube and we can play that video also. So it's the same video again. Thank you for watching and God bless.